Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. So in this video, we have brought you a one more project which is based on Spring Boot, which is backend is Java, means Spring Boot application, Java project, and front end is Angular. As you can see in the screen, this entire thing is made through Angular and Bootstrap for the design purpose. Okay, but the front end is Angular. So I have already started my backend application over in the Eclipse, and also I have started my front end server as well. So now I will show you the demonstration of this project work here, how this project is going to work and what is the concept of this project, everything. All right. So here, when you start this project for the first time, you can able to see a labor and an employer. Like suppose there are few, just assume that there are few labors in your city, let's say in Bangalore and uh, employer means you, you stay in Bangalore city. Okay. So you want to hire a pump plumber or a hire a electrician for your housework okay for plumbing work or electrician work so what you can do you can go to this uh, online platform and you can able to hire a labor like you can schedule uh, you can send a request for the labor and you can schedule a labor like whenever you want okay so this is how this project is going to work all right so labor uh, get a jobs through this particular platform so this is the online project which we have made over here so i hope you guys understood the pro, uh, concept over here uh, if not understood that's fine so you want to understand it much more better when you see the demonstration all right so here just assume that uh, i'm as of now i'm logging as a labor okay so just see this is an online platform which will be available for everyone and if an electrician want to get a job, you can come to this particular website and you can register in this website. Okay. So let's say labor login. Since if the labor is accessing for the first time, means you need to register obviously. So just click on sign up over here. Then you can give a name. So let's say I'll give some name over here. Let's say uh, Kuma. All right. So, um, okay. There's a placeholder. Message. Okay. No problem. So let's say kumar at uh, mail.com and a specialization specialization could be like electrician you, you can take it as electrician but make sure you should not uh, uh, make any mistake work here because the spelling has to be very perfect so uh, to cross check that let me see the work type or uh, okay no problem work here okay let me enter the uh, let's say i'll enter plumber okay let's say plumber so p l u M B yeah, plumber okay so taluk let's say i'll give one taluk called sulia okay so village you, you need to give a village as well over here okay so i have already included few villages in the website i mean uh, uh in the database already so i'll take one village from that itself okay so let's say let's say uh, let me take one so that we'll get uh, just a second i'm just checking in the db like I'll show you um, uh, the database as well so that you'll get an idea what all the villages which I have already included these are the villages which has been already included so uh, okay I'll take this one okay J A L S O R okay so this J A L S O R okay so area and you can specify the area uh, whichever the uh, area you can include that so let's say some street okay like first cross something like that so you can include all the address so you need to enter the poster pin code as well okay so you can uh, give the pin code as of now i'll just enter the pin code over here all right so phone number i'll just randomly enter some phone number over here let's say 987654 okay and the password so just enter the password and register as a labor all right so this data has been saved so now like what are the information which we give just now so we we'll log in with that labor okay we we'll log in with that labor over here all right so let's say so the phone number which i have gave is so yes okay let me give the phone number over here phone number is 987654 and the password i'll give the password over here and sign it okay okay oh i have made a mistake 987654 okay now sign in see we have logged in so this is a dashboard of a labor so as you can see labor can able to edit the profile okay so uh, this is the screen difference okay i'll just show you so yeah labor can able to edit the profile we have registered kumar just now right you can labor can able to edit the phone number password 
pin code area village so you can able to edit that as well so this is the one more feature and one more thing so what are the schedules are there that can be checked by this labor and what are the work requests can be checked since uh, he is he has been uh, registered for the first time now so he won't get any schedules and work requests so how we can able to get that get this so this request can get from employer itself like suppose if you want a, a, an electrician or a plumber for the work means you can able to hire that employee okay i mean got it means employees are a labor all right so employer means you are hiring so login as employee suppose if you are a new person okay so uh, to this particular system is you need to register for yourself as well so as of now i'll sign up okay uh, I'll, i'll include few names over here let's say uh, kiran okay kiran so kiran at uh, mail.com so taluk you can include any uh, taluk you want and i'll include same village itself okay area second uh, main road something like that all right so and uh, give all your personal information which are they over here and uh, 5750 and the phone number let's say like this okay this is the phone number which i gave small only for an example purpose and the password is done okay so this details has been saved all right so i have already I means it's been saved so it's been already directly logged in as an employer suppose if it is not logged in you need to log in as an employer again okay so let me log in as an employer by entering the username and the password over here so let's say let's say uh, yes so it's kiran oh wait here we gave a number right or the username okay let me check we gave phone number over here so we need to enter what we need to enter the phone number 87545 this is the user phone number which i had gave and i'll enter the password as well so like this and sign in so now i have signed in as an employer okay so now employer can able to select a work suppose if you want a mason or from which particular taluk or from which village so as of now i have included only two two taluk okay uh, wait wait just a second just a second all right okay so it is getting loaded just a second so employer okay so i have included only two taluks and what all the villages comes under these two taluks i have included those villages over here but you can include all uh, what whichever the taluk you want you can able to include it over here I, it's up to you all right so uh, i'll select uh, suppose i want a uh, mason okay from sulia taluk and from uh, what is that village name which we have included there um it start from j something jaisalu okay jalsur so search so this is the there is a nivedita named uh, employer is there okay you can able to schedule it but as of now we'll select a plumber which we have registered just now and search over here see now we got a kumar which we have registered now so you can directly call or hire him means okay so this is just uh, for uh, look and feel and here you can able to schedule when you want that employee for your work okay so let's say uh, let's say you want tomorrow and from what time like suppose uh, evening 5 o'clock till uh, uh, one hour of uh, that particular uh, employer or the labor okay so let's go back a little bit okay i need to select it again it's been loaded <laughs> just a second so let me select plumber taluk is sulia and the village is uh, jal jalso where is that okay jalso and search and okay let me select the plumber again okay let me refresh it because we are not getting the data so let's check again just a second yeah so uh, plumber and uh, taluk sulia and jalsur and the search button so here we got our uh, uh, kuma work here this is the labor which are available at this particular place so let's say i'll give some random time okay so schedule so now this scheduled request will go to whom will go to kumar okay so kumar has been already logged in work here we'll see that but here you can see pending schedule means this is the pending so kumar has to accept the request okay 
so we have sent a request for kumar kumar has to accept after that only this plumber job will be assigned for him okay the status is pending as you can see right so now we have already logged in as a kumar work here so now i'll go to wait wait let's just get loaded quickly okay so work request see this is the work which request which came to kumar work here so kumar plumber sulia jalsur first cross these are the details of that particular employer okay so you can accept or you can reject it so as of now i'll accept work here and i click on save got it so i can go for my schedules as you can see this is the schedule is there from uh, 4 o'clock tomorrow to 6 o'clock at this date okay this is the phone number of an employer and this is all the information all right so here since it's showing as pending if you refresh or if you go for the schedules over here i'll just show you quickly schedules this has been scheduled as you can see kumar plumber sulia status has been accepted so everything has been done through online now right so like in the real time they'll come to your place and uh, whatever the work uh, you want to make like plumber electrician mass and anything that can be done so this is how labor can able to get the job and employer can get the labor for the work all right i hope you understand the concept okay so if you need any project like blockchain machine learning data science or mobile application web development spring application java fx projects computer graphics projects uh, designs posters these are all kind of different projects we do and that project will be coming up soon as well so if you have any topic so based on your topic also we'll make project for you all right also mini project final projects everything so i hope you understand this concept a labor and employer concept all right so if you understand the concept and if you're new to our channel please do subscribe and if you like this video just click a like button and we'll meet in our next video until then take care goodbye bye bye